so now we have the brackets done and I am going to print a new one with a different material which withstand 215 degrees Celsius it's gonna be better I, this is gonna be totally fine because we're not gonna reach 190 and now it's time for the harness so at first I'm going to make my harness but I also intend to make harnesses and put on my website for you guys but this is how I'm gonna make it I'm gonna make as short as possible so I'm not gonna keep slacks like I did on the BMW I'm gonna cut this guy I'm gonna solder in here I'm gonna use this kind of heat shrink here it becomes hard and has some sort of glue inside also we're gonna use this kind of loom in here the, the link for all this material will be will be in the description I open a hole in between the wires here so I can go through with the wire from the other connector now I open split it up and I wrap around so even if somehow the solder fail this is not gonna get out of here there you go all right so I needed to deping this because I didn't want to leave this ugly and here we go and there you go two down I gotta do exactly the same thing all the way down as I go down this here is going to increase because those are the signals so now I gotta see what's the distance between this bracket and this bracket so I know exactly where this coil goes and then I can make the next plug I'm gonna put this on here I'm gonna tighten it and so we know exactly where it goes okay now we do like that look at that be the wiring now the two last ones I need to make a mark there and there so my what I'm gonna do now I'm gonna bolt them all up let me do that there we go so this goes right there and look at that it's gonna be tucked in it's gonna be super nice so apart from being sure that Positive is with positive, negative with negative, which means red and black, right? They are together. We have the signals and we are going to pair up number one with number six, number two with number five, and number three and four. Be sure you get that right. All right, so everything is done. It's beautiful. Now we got the connectors. We're going to keep the male on this side and if you male on the other one. So I'm gonna crimp them all. I'm gonna put the clip to the top and I'm gonna do black on the bottom here, red on the top. Now we're gonna go one, two, and three. So white and red is one, goes on top. White and black is the second one. And then this gray one. Now we're gonna put this in there. So we put like that and we push, done. Connector is locked and then when we have the other one ready we just connect bam and that's it harness is ready those are the adapters those are the support you got this guy here bam and installing the car i am happy <sighs> productive weekend went for a ride with eclipse finished my harness it took forever probably four hours to make this harness so those coils here for the Nissan R35 GTR uh, they are too tall so we got these guys here I made those with the material that doesn't melt those guys here they are not the right material they are just a prototype but the right material ones are in the car they are carbon fiber nylon they are PA12 which withstand 195 Celsius and I'm gonna try and see how it is to make those we're using PA6 which is going to be able to reach around 200 degrees Celsius so that's gonna be better uh, either way I don't think we're gonna have any issues I hope you guys enjoy and do not miss the next videos and